very Christmas vibes right here. The two I oh oh snap. You're literally on a box of honey crunches of oats right now. Oh gosh. Okay. Aloha Eka Ohana. Welcome back. Target haul and Vera Bradley haul. I asked on Instagram if you wanted a Target haul, but we actually just came home from Vera Bradley. Keep up with me on Instagram. There's a lot of behind the scenes on Instagram that goes on and Snapchat. And I'm also a TikToker now. All of those handles are Kapokuhana. We'll start off first with Target because I asked y'all on Instagram if you wanted a haul. So I will stick to Target first. And then I thought I'd just throw in Vera Bradley because why not? We actually went to Target yesterday and then I'm also gonna show you a bunch of stuff that I got when we went the other week, last week. So just, just bear with me. So of course we're all in the Christmas holiday spirit and we got some Christmas holiday stuff. <laughs> I'll actually show you the stockings that we got first. We don't have any stockings for our Ohana for Kelly and I and Bebe. We got these three. This is the Wondershop brand. So this one is for Papa. It's like a gray faux fur. And then these two are for Baby and I. So very cream colored beige type of vibe because that's just the type of vibe that I'm into. <laughs> this will probably be a little stocking. But I mean, they're for decoration more than anything. These were 15 bucks each. Very, very cute. Okay, and then for our tree, we ordered our tree from Amazon and it was supposed to be coming in today, but I haven't gotten any notification. That's coming in, it's supposed to be today. That was supposed to be last week, but didn't happen. So it's gonna happen hopefully today, if not sometime this week. But the ornaments, I did pick up some at Target and sticking to the white theme, of course, we got these cute little ones from Target. This is like a crisp snowflake and then this is like I don't know what this this is like a mm, how do you describe this ornament that's how you describe it but it's very cute very snowflakey flaky flaky how many did I get of those and when we went to Target everything was in shambles and uh, kind of had to scrounge around because you know people don't put things back where they belong so you kind of have to sift through all the stuff and I found a pretty good amount of these I didn't find a lot of the crystal ones which sad about because these are really really cute one two three four five six seven eight of these three dollars each and then of the crystal ones we only got two so we'll figure out where to place these on the tree when it does come in and this last ornament i saw on target.com and i was hoping that they had it in store and they did kane found it it's a little our home our what our new home ornament 2020. This one is also, this one was six bucks. I thought this was cute. Cream colored with a touch of gold at the top for the roof. And then a little, it's like a heart shaped dang thingy. Very cute. I actually should just put this stuff back in the bag before I start piling things all over the place. And then we also got regular ball ornaments. White, acrylic, and like this crystal type of textured ornament. Very cute. There was actually one missing, so we got a percentage off. Make sure you check. There was one missing down here in the corner. So we caught that one and got like a discount. Wrapping paper. And these were, I think, three bucks each. This silver textured one. We also got this very, you know, silvery, crystally type of vibe. And then just this plain beige colored one. They don't have much on the roll, 25 square feet each. They had the longer rolls with a lot more wrapping paper on them, but they were like the colorful snowman type of vibe. <laughs> so that was from last week, Target haul. Let's go to yesterday Target haul. We picked up some home stuff. First thing, we upgraded our bed. We've been sleeping on a full bed for quite some time now, but we did recently upgrade to a king. So of course, the bedding that you have to purchase along with it will have to come at some point. So that's what we did. Threshold, king size, organic sheet set. It's like an off white, it's not a pure white, but it comes with a flat sheet, fitted sheet, two king pillowcases. So we. Oh, hello. We actually picked this up too from last week's Target run. <laughs> I'm just gonna warn you right now. You're gonna see a lot, a lot, a lot of blankets. I'm just a sucker for blankets. Let's just leave it at that. This one is also the Threshold brand. I just love the texture, the color. This is, this is the vibe. This is the vibe. And then from this week's, <laughs> from this week's haul, Got another blanket. <laughs> also threshold, this is a full queen size micro plush blanket. Oh. Oh. Mm. That's all I can say. <gasps> These were on sale. Normal price I think was 40 bucks. It was on sale for like 15, $20. Of course we had to buy one, of course. And then for our comforter, here it is. Nice plush, 
this is it's not full fur this is oh this full fur full fur comforter set also by the threshold brand this is a big girl purchase i've just always loved baskets full of blankets just available for anybody who comes over so that's what i'm looking for next is these baskets for uh blankets that i'm collecting <laughs> i think it's just the homey vibe that blankets give to people or you know just what it brings to the house i feel like blankets make a house a home um just because it keeps people warm and it just brings people together you can cuddle up with your cakey or your other half you know but blankets i did I, I don't know i don't know what it is i love it i love blankets and so that's one of my next projects is to find baskets big enough to hold at least five blankets um there was one that i was looking at at target it was just too small i was like okay no way that's only gonna fit maybe two blank two three blankets i mean if they're this size two two at the most maybe three um so we're on the hunt for some nice aesthetically pleasing type of baskets but that can come down later later on this is all from yesterday's target run oh i'm so glad i finally picked this up neutrogena rapid wrinkle repair retinol retinol fragrance free important fragrance free i've always wanted to incorporate a retinol into my skincare routine but i was just never able to one because when i first had baby i was breastfeeding so it's not recommended at all to use during pregnancy or even during i think if you're breastfeeding but since i'm not breastfeeding anymore we can incorporate her also i just really wanted to get my skin to a point where i was understanding what the products that i was using what they were doing for me because i had no idea because i was using all different types of things now there's only three things that i use i know what ingredients are in them they're just keeping my skin healthy and clean once i incorporate this then i'll be able to see the pros and cons because the three products that i use already which is a face wash sunscreen and moisturizer i mean for the past year i think i'm dedicated to those three products i think i'm finally ready to incorporate something new i'm kind of nervous but excited at the same time because i know that you have to be very diligent with sunscreen using retinol which i already am so that's a good big thumbs up this will only be during my nighttime routine so this should go a long way and i probably am only gonna start once a week just to see how my skin reacts to it big ups to dr dre for introducing this she recommends it so that's why stay updated with me on my instagram at kubokoyana because i will definitely be sharing when i open this baby and when i first use it so keep up to date with me on there i got another ornament for yesterday's run qk qk right the problem is i don't know when i'm gonna get the chance to print out a photo of us to get into this frame i hope it'll be soon what i hope to do is get the tree in decorate it as soon as possible take a little family just at home pajamas type of vibe christmas photo and then uh use like an online christmas card maker and send those out and then those same photos that we take then put it in here that's gonna be a project but i'm hoping we can get it done and then this can go up on the tree i think these two go together so cute oh i'm so excited for this pajama set <laughs> stars above size double x it comes with pants and a long sleeve button up very very soft my black robe and my slip dress that i wore when i had havala basically all i wear when i'm at home figured i'd pick up another set because i do plan on taking our christmas photos in this set and then trying to find kane not a same colored set you know what i mean but they just don't make cream colored anything for men it's been kind of tricky trying to find something for him to wear for the photos but this was 30 bucks very cute very cute two loofahs can you guess which one is mine <laughs> you can't because i love gray and i love cream colored stuff but this one is mine this one is for kane this is also very exciting flamingo the flamingo tarot and rose gold razor okay high hopes for this 10 bucks but it came with a razor handle a five blade two five blade cartridges and a shower holder i'm very lazy when it comes to shaving so i'm hoping this aesthetically pleasing razor will help encourage me be more into shaving on it. i probably just bought it 90 percent because of the looks but i've heard good reviews about it so excited to try ah oh my god six months six months and with little feet little feet 
So it doesn't have the cover for the hands, but that's okay. I like to put baby into these jumpsuits at night because it gets a little nippy. I mean, we didn't really need this, but I, ugh, this thing is on clearance, 50% off. This is actually new from Avino, so I don't know why it was on clearance all of a sudden. The oat repairing cream, this just came out. Prebiotic oat concentrate, fragrance free. What else does it have? Petrolatum, glycerin. Again, I saw Dr. Dre talk about these products. 15.39 to 7, what, 69? Can never go without enough cream or lotion or moisturizer anywhere throughout the house. Okay, I think that was it for Target. Okay, wait, one more thing. Thankful rug for the kitchen, period. Oh, and then I can show you this. I remember showing it in my stories. Soft cashmere and lavender with notes of white thyme and sage. Mm, beautiful. This is from the Threshold brand too. What's crazy about this candle is even when it's lit, you can't really smell it unless you walk to certain areas of the house. I don't does that i mean even when you're sitting here we have it on our dining table you can't really smell it but when you get up and walk away to the kitchen then you get a little whiff of it i know people that can't handle very strong smells or fragrances so i like that that one's very subtle and cool that you can only smell it in certain parts of the house it's very bradley time if you don't already know, Vera Bradley always has incredible sales, especially during the winter season. They always have like a 50 plus an additional 30. This time we went was 70% off of everything. Ugh. It's crazy that I love Vera as much as I do because I really love plain, no print anything. And if you know Vera Bradley, everything with her is print and colorful. <laughs> I stick to my aesthetic type of color-ish. I think what Vera Bradley is most known for are her blankets, her throws. Okay, her blankets are super long and they're wide. Being that I'm 5'9, 5'10, you know, a lot of blankets just cut short to like my calf or my ankle. I can't have that. I can't have none of that business. I need it to cover my whole kino. And Vera Bradley, her blankets do just that. And I already have a couple of them too. There's one that I have that I've had for years and it's still my favorite to this day. The. <laughs> Can you guess what color it is? <laughs> and I love the print too. <laughs> Sabretooth, black and white. This was from, I think, three or four years ago. And again, if you know Vera Bradley, her prints, they're like common goal. You either get it or you're done. Blanket sale was two for 35. There were select blankets. So I'll show you the ones that were on that sale and then the ones that weren't. Do you die? Look at this print. Oh my gosh. It's all white, but it has just the, the color. It's like red and peach and dark blue. I don't know what it is. She gets her colors. This print is called Exuberant Floral. My mom wanted me to pick her up a set. She wanted this print and she also wanted this black floral. This is cute too. This is the Tangerine Twist print. Two for 35, by the way. I don't know if that's online too or if it's just in the store. I don't know. So the two that I got that were on sale, the Exuberant Floral and this cute one. Very much, you know, still in the colored tone aesthetic vibe, you know, like grayish blue, but it has the polar bears on it. You know what? Forget it. I'm just gonna open it for you right here, right now. I need the scissors. No, I don't. The cute little drawstring. Oh, I love. Oh, I love it. Can you, can you just, oh, oh, you're kidding me. Giving me very much Christmas at home type. Hello. I love it. I love it so much. This is so cute. It's like mom and and baby polar bear. And it has trees on them too. Okay, that's this one. Oh, the next two blankets I got were not on sale, but they were still 70% off individually. So, yeah. <laughs> Regular price, $79, 70% off, $24. This cute little, it's still the polar bear thing, but I, I'll just open it. I just can't, can't tease you guys like this. Drawstring, love it, look. Look at it. Look at the polar bears. Oh, Christmas morning. Oh, <laughs> it's so cute. I'm just throwing them over here. And then the other one, not two for 35, but still 70% off in vision. And the other blanket, are you ready? Are you just, just brace yourself, girl. Have yourself. <laughs> Come on. Warm December. Can you see the detail? I don't even know if you can see the detail on there, but it glistens, it shines, it's pretty, it's cream colored, and the stars are gray. I don't know how much cuter you can get than that. Vera just hits it out of the park with her blankets. Ah. A sucker form. Clearly. This bag actually came free with purchase. Cute little moment. I love these for when we go to Target, Costco, whatever. You know? This is Penelope's Garden. Comes with a little pocket on the inside. Cute. And this, when 
I am a Keurig. I don't know when, not anytime soon after all of this stuff that I just bought. A mug, frosted floral. It's so pretty. This is like a gray tone purple or like a, a dark lavender. And then the flowers are this different shades of this grayish purple. And then we also picked up an eke. Can't go to Bear Bradley without picking up at least one eke. This material though, it's different. It's a new type of material that Vera is using now. Ultra light collection. It's lightweight water repellent material. Big reason why I wanted to get this because this is the first that I've ever seen her use this type of material. And then in the print, hello, it's just like a plus plus. It comes with a big opening, comes with pockets. It also comes with a big white strap. It has compartments on the back, on the sides, on the front, and then the two buckles to attach that strap to. And then it also has this part for your suitcase. So the part that you pull out of the suitcase to pull around and lay around behind you or whatever, comes with that too. So good. And I thought this could be baby's upgrade diaper bag eventually. Cause you know, when we do end up going back to the beach and when things open up again, whatever, I really appreciate, oh look, she even has her brand name on here. Top notch, high quality. This was what, 159 and we got it for $48, 50 bucks, I think. So that's a hundred dollars off. I'm trying to convince myself that I saved money, which I think I did, but you know. <laughs> And because this is water repellent and water resistant, it's like a plus because the one that we have now is working really fine, really great. It's a backpack style diaper bag from Amazon that we purchased, but you know, just if you wanted to upgrade to another bigger bag down the road, then we have this. Ha. Okay, that, that's, that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you wanna see more hauls, just let me know in the comments down below. I know hauls are very old school, but I think that's what I miss the most about YouTube is old school YouTube. So if you wanna see more of these, then just let me know in the comments down below. It's like I just closed my eyes and blacked out and reached out and whatever I grabbed, I purchased. Love you and I'm very thankful for you. And I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving and I hope you have a great holiday Christmas season. I'm sure you all are shopping yourselves. This is the weekend of Black Friday and Cyber Monday Monday coming tomorrow so we'll see what happens tomorrow thank you guys so much for watching and joining me mahalo nui don't forget to follow me on instagram like my facebook page i'm also on snapchat with more behind the scenes things and i know i mentioned it before but i'm also on tiktok so consider following me there mahalo nui for watching and i'll see you guys very soon we hope